the one reason, two reasons why I use the frozen mm -hmm. is it's readily available. They pick it at the pretty much peak ripeness. Now, sometimes you'll get, when Nadie and I were talking, you might get some some uh, fruit that's not really, really, really sweet. But sometimes the strawberries are like off the chart sweet, you know, and I give them to the grandchildren and they munch on them. Mm -hmm. um, but, uh, and they make good smoothies because they're frozen. Okay. So, so you don't have to add ice to it. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. you don't have to add ice because they're already frozen. So they're, it's perfect for smoothies. And then we're gonna make what I call the green machine um, uh, simply because the naked drink that you buy that cost you almost have to hawk your car, you know, yeah. you know, anyway, you have to sell your gold. Uh, Aww. Aww. <laughs> yeah, recycling. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> recycle. And I put, uh, so you'll see what I've got here. All right, so we've got the mixture of, it's got peaches, strawberries, mangoes, pineapple, okay? And um, uh, so we'll put that right here, my lovely assistant, Stephanie. <laughs> And I just had some soy milk, so I'm using soy. I normally use almond milk, but I had soy on hand, so I just brought that. And you've got almond, almond. Okay, you show them your almond drink. And I like almond. I we just that's what we drink at our house, and the grandbabies love it. <laughs> and uh, so we might even need a lovely assistant, so you can leave that out. We'll put this right here. So so you've got you know obviously the almond milk and the you know soy milk, and we. You know, get unsweetened, you can get vanilla, you know. But remember, that the one thing you want to do, you don't want to really add any sugar because we're really trying to keep monitor yeah. that and keep that, you know, keep the sugar level way down, okay? So you put things in it that's going to sweeten your smoothie. So I was telling Nady, you know, sometimes they're not sweet, so you put bananas in it. Bananas will make it sweet. The ripe, the, the make it sweet. The riper, the better. So if you get uh, the ones at, at Lowe's, you can get, they're discounted. They're in a bag already. Uh, Harris Teeter might have them. Mm -hmm. But they're already like two or three days old, and they're sweeter. And you can put them in the freezer, and they'll make, uh, and if you have fresh fruit, mm -hmm. put these in the freezer, and they'll make it uh, thick like a milkshake. All right, so this makes it... Um, uh, sweet and thick at the same time. And uh, I don't <laughs> always add an apple, but they do make it sweet. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I just thought we'd, we'd kind of see. Maybe we will. Maybe we won't. I don't know. Anyways. <laughs> and the spinach. This is what, this really kicks it over the top and makes it healthy. Mm -hmm. And you don't have to use much. And when you cook it, because it's water, that, you know how much this is going to be? This is going to be like that much. <laughs> you might get two bites. You know, but when you put them in a smoothie, because it's it's uh, all these little cellulose things in here, it's just water. So you don't have to use as much, just a handful, okay? And I call it the green machine. So we're going to make this. All right, so. Do you want to switch places? I will. <laughs> so I always, um, I start with, uh, you know, start with, and uh, for Vernon and I, I'll use a couple of cups. Use two cups. So I'm going to go ahead and... That's a full cup, so go ahead. It's a full cup. Yeah, so I'm going to do... Okay, right here. I can see it. <coughs> All right, so there's two. I'll use some more. All right, anyway, and I'm going to uh, put in a handful of... A couple of handfuls of spinach. Well, that ought to be... You don't have to use much, like I said. Don't have to use much. And uh, we'll cut up our bananas in here. Boy, that's a... That's okay. the way you're supposed to do it. And the way do. I, yeah, you're supposed to do it the other way. <laughs> and, I, and, I, and that's true. And I usually do it, and I don't even know why I did that. And what I do is I do this. I cut it right. I do that. You don't have to, but I'm just, just I'm used to doing it. And I do it on here because there you go, and you won't cut yourself. All right. And, ta-da, one lovely assistant. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of times I just do it like that. What <laughs> how I do it. Okay, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, you can cut that one down the middle. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Gee, Vanna. <laughs> Vanna doesn't talk. Gee, Vanna, you never, you never do that on the show. <laughs> All right, so we're, what we're going to do is we're going to get it started first, okay? And I'm going to put the frozen veggies in right away. I'm going to, uh, because this neat little thing comes in. I just got the plunger. Did you? <laughs> I just got it the other day. Mine was missing, so I bought me a new one. I was so happy. All right, now this one isn't like mine. Mine is just the just the commercial one and gone and, and up and down. All right, so we got this it on. Stages. This okay, one is first. all right. 
Mine's the commercial one, and it goes like low and high, and that's it. All right, I'm going to put that right here. All right, now let's taste it to see if it is indeed sweet enough. I just brought the, I, uh, the apples just in case. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it's good. It's good. It's definitely good. It's definitely good. Okay. All right. Good job. So here we go. Oh, All right. Oh, oh, oh. Got the cups. And uh, so I just, this is, this, and now, like I said, you are not, this is not graven in stone, okay? Might have to make some more. I, you know, I, I, am so, I was going to say, I am so into like, yeah, let's do the whole cup here. Oh, wrap it up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so here we have it. Please enjoy your green machine. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, I wrapped it up. Mm -hmm.